Welcome to the latest edition of my podcast. I am Newt Bailey. Before we get started, please send me any requests that you have for subject matter that you'd love for me to cover. For today, imagine that you've just come out of a meeting and someone says to you, you made me look like a complete fool in that meeting. <sighs> how would you respond? I'd like to just uh, do a little bit of how I might respond to that. Here's how I wouldn't respond to it. Well, you were making yourself look like a fool. I didn't have to do much work, really. Tempting, perhaps, but it's just going to create a mess, you know? It's just a thought that you're having about them. They're having a thought about you. You're having a thought about them. Often it's uh, a risk to start expressing the first thoughts which come to mind, right? So here's what I might do. Um, I made you look a fool. Yeah, you made me look a fool. You know exactly what I'm talking about. Um, I'd like to know exactly what it is. Um, I don't have a lot of time right now, so I'm wondering if we could talk about it some other time, because I'd really like to get clear on what it was that I did. Well, I don't see that I need to talk to you about it, just don't do it again. I definitely don't want to do it again, whatever it was, because I um, want to have a smooth, harmonious working relationship between us, and it sounds like that's not what's going on right now. I also want to um, totally be respectful in my working relationship with you, so I would, would really love if you'd be willing to, like, I don't know, meet me for half an hour or something this afternoon, tomorrow afternoon. Is that something you'd be willing to do? Yeah, we can talk about it. Okay. So, that's my first response. Why like this? I'm just demonstrating that you don't necessarily have to deal with it immediately just because it's seeming pretty pressing and this person is seeming pretty angry. Um, I would want to go away and check in with myself. You know, do I have some issues with this person, actually? Is there something that I want to say to him or her, which I haven't already said? Is it maybe coming out in ways which are less conscious? Or was I actually trying to irritate him or to um, turn people against him in some way? Him or her. I'd want to go away and I'd want to check on that. And then after that, to come back to have a conversation. So let's break it down. Uh, what was in my response to this angry claim that I'd made this person look like a fool? Well, for one thing, I chose not to go into counter-attack, accusation, insult, judgment, criticism, blame, those things are generally pretty ineffective, so they're not my first port of call unless my anger is so much that I'm not conscious about what I'm doing. And then maybe I'll sort of accidentally go into those things. What I did want to do, though, was to just uh, say, this is something I want to be responsive to. Whatever you're saying is something that I want to be responsive to. So I would like to talk about this. And I also said... Here's why I would like to be responsive to it. I would like us to have a respectful, harmonious working relationship. That's what I'm wanting. So that's why I want to. Like, What, what are the values of mine? What's my purpose in, in responding in the way that I'm responding? And then I made a request. My request was that we uh, talk about it some other time. I could have made the request that we talk about it right now, you know, or some other request, who knows. So something clear that I'm asking this person, you know, some response that I'm asking for, and we had to go back and forth a little bit about it, you know. 